loot's already started. Alright, and they're three capping us. What's up guys? Graham here. Playing a little bit of the Reaver action, and there's two red names. Let's avoid those. Well, unless he comes after me. Alright. Ah, oh, it's a stinking Inquisitor. Alright, already stripping my buffs. Let's go ahead and throw it to him. Ah, I got an ally helping me out. Good deal. Yeah. Inquisitors are so strong, man. Alright, let's take on this guy. Another Inquisitor. Are you serious? Already stripping my boss? <sighs> okay. Oh, CC'd and tried to burst me down. Let's line aside all that. Alright. Let's go ahead. Uh, he's soul streaming right whenever I was viral streaming. Alright, let's interrupt that Nisser's rebuke. And down he goes. Oh man, good thing I had a healer there. Jeez, man. Inquisitors are just so good. Everybody wants to talk about how overpowered Reaver is and everything. Man, Inquisitor. It's got all the CC. It's got the self heals. It's got all that burst. It's got the able to strip people's buffs. Everything going for it. So, yeah. Nothing's overpowered like an Inquisitor. Well, it looks like somebody else is watching that flag, so let's go ahead and go towards the middle. Oh, just one person here? Piece of cake. Let's go ahead and... Is this another cleric? Oh, shaman, shaman. No, 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 no. Whoa. That deep freeze about ate me alive there. Got to get away from that. Who plays shaman these days? What's up with that? Awesome burst, but man, his survivability is terrible, so let's go up and pick on him. Shaman just has such bad survivability, but yeah, that burst about took me down. Yep, yeah, just a matter of sealing the deal on him. Alright, yeah. Not gonna let me drink, but I got heals, so. And that's exactly why you put Warlord in a PvP Reaver build, so you can pull people down. Oh man, that's a lot of them. Got a line of sight, make sure they don't start focusing me. Oh, my viral stream, right whenever he was doing a biofeedback. That means that my viral stream was pretty much completely wasted. Alright, so these guys, ah, dang it, can't click on the dang healer. Oh well, we got him dotted up, I bet, so that's what matters. Reduction in heals. Uh, let's go ahead and attack from the back here. Get a little bit of the attention diverted, that way they're not all focused at one area. Oh man, that sneaky guy. He he actually capped Codex. I thought we had it. And he capped it behind us. I was running around the building, so I didn't get to see that. Alright, gotta bring down the heels. This dude's running a Chloromancer build? Oh, that means he's gonna die. Sadly, that's what Chloromancer is these days. It's just fodder for DPS. Put out some big heal numbers, but yeah, the single target heals are absolutely garbage. What quartered beast? Uh, uh, guys running champion? So we've got a champion and we've gotten a shaman here. These guys, you gotta give them points for creativity. Running stuff that normally isn't being run. Because who plays Cleric and actually thinks about running Shaman these days? Juggernaut. You know, everybody's playing Inquisitor because they're so strong. But. And this guy is running Tempest. What? This team, man. I kind of like them. 
<laughs> he did a false repose. He faked his death there. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't be CCing me, man. Charged Pulse. Gosh, I haven't seen that in a Warfront in a long time. Nobody runs Tempest anymore. Because Reaver is just so strong at range. I mean, if you're going to run a range spec, normally you're always going to run Reaver. For Warriors, anyway. Throwing down the deeps on this Reaver here. That guy's running Reaver. Come on, finish you off. I don't know why they got him marked as a one. He's not a healer or anything. He was a, he was a reaver. All right. Gosh, they have a 200-point lead on us. Man, see, they keep on pressure in the center here. And, you know, I'm, I'm wanting to go cap some other stuff, but you, you can't even leave. Because they keep on pressure in the center. Alright, so, yeah, see, look, they're up there on the cliffs and everything. They're they're just waiting for us to leave. If they cap the codex right now, we're, we're probably going to lose. Alright, pull you down. See, look, they keep on attacking decks right now. Man, we've got to cap some other stuff. they got 910 points already, and we're only at 750. We are in some trouble. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to let you get away. <laughs> he jumped down there and did the biofeedback, and I, I just had to jump down and take care of him. He, he was not going to survive after being that low in health. Gosh, they keep on pressure and decks. They're at 950 points. We're only at 810 at the moment. 824 now. Oh, we got him four cap. Nice, because their whole team is here trying to take decks. Well, a lot of them are. So that's allowing our guys to get... Ah, uh, they defended Vault. Uh, they're at 968 points. Uh, 972. Dang it. We're not even at 900 right now. But we're about to have them three capped. Uh, they only need 20 more points. Uh, we got to get vault. We've got to get vault no matter what right now. Oh, one of our guys got it. Okay, we got to stop them from capping. We, we got to make sure they don't cap. All right, sorry, Shaven. You're not going to be able to do it. I'm going to make sure of it. They're at 992 points. Oh, are we going to take this? We got them four capped. 990? Nice! A thousand! Oh my gosh, they were six points away from winning. Holy smoke, that was a heck of a comeback right there. Uh, we went second highest in kills, only 7-0, but yeah, it was a low kill war front, lots of heals. So, yeah, that was a heck of a comeback, man. Alright, if you guys like this video, make sure to hit that like button. And if you're new to Rift, make sure you use my referral code in the description below. As usual, guys, my name is Grim. And I'll see you next time.